If you clicked on this video, you are looking for ways to list faster. I have been messing around with List Perfectly's new listing assistant, Express Lister, and it has made me list much faster than the way that I was doing it before. So this is going to be one of the fastest ways that you can list in 2024. I want to show you how it works and then give you some tips on using it. Uh, before what I was doing is I was taking photos on my phone, uploading them to eBay, and then I would go to my computer, take them from eBay, import them to list perfectly, and from there if that item I could cross post to Poshmark, I would. And I was kind of using list perfectly as a second place to house all of the listings. So not only were they in eBay, but they were also in list perfectly, which to me really, really helped if let's say I was going through our inventory and an item was not on eBay anymore, like it got delisted. We all know if you sell on eBay, that can sometimes happen with old inventory. Maybe somebody didn't pay and I forgot to relist it and then I can't find that listing again. I would go to list perfectly, find it, and then I was able to easily cross post it back to eBay. Now that was a lot of steps because I was uploading to eBay, from eBay importing to list perfectly, and then from list perfectly having to uh, cross post to, well, I guess Macari or Poshmark, depending on the item. Another thing I was doing is I found myself, I found myself wasting way too much time when I would list just directly to eBay. I was always looking for a similar item to do sell similar, whether it was in my account, something I sold before, or something that was already listed, or something that has sold. So I was spending a lot of time scrolling and then trying to look for something. I'd get distracted on my phone, and I really was wasting a lot of time listing, and it just became a bore to me. I was tired of listing. I didn't want to do it anymore. I love to go sourcing. So what I found was that was not enjoyable to me listing. So I would go out and source and then those items would just kind of stack up around the house. And we live in a smaller two bedroom house and we utilize, I'm in the spare bedroom right now, I utilize it for recording YouTube videos, for listing, storing items as you can see behind me. Um, these are all the hats that I know I need to list and prep. Um, and then I also have the, the rack of the clothing that needs to be listed as well. So we don't have a lot of space, and so when you aren't listing, then it's just gonna pile up. So it just became very frustrating, and I honestly stopped cross-posting at one point. I just, I was done with it. I was done with listing, but I'm back, and I feel good about it, and I'm excited about this tool, and I definitely wanna share it with you guys. There is not an app for List Perfectly. However, it is mobile friendly. So you can go to a browser on your phone and you can log in that way. So that's how I've been doing it. Before I show you how it works, I just want to let you know that you do have to have their top tier, their top plan, and that is the pro plan. And then you have to opt into their pro plus that they are giving everybody for pretty much free until the end of the year, I believe, because this is still, this. even though this tool is fantastic, it is still in beta and they're still making improvements. I already photoed five items that I want to show you how it works, um, and they're actually behind me, so I'll show you exactly what they are. All right, so the first item is going to be this Ed Hardy wallet. So we're gonna go to my phone and I'll show you exactly how it works. All right, so I'm going to screen record this. So as I am doing it, you're able to see on my right, your left, um, exactly what I am doing. So you get an idea of how it works. So you would go to, and once again, you have to have the opt into the Pro Plus plan. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go down to new. I'm going to select images, and I'm gonna go down to that Ed Hardy wallet. I'm gonna select one, two, three, four, five, six. You can add more than six, but just so you know, it takes the, the AI only looks at the first six photos that you take. And it does take a few seconds, and what you're doing is waiting for the listing assistant button. Right now it's gray. You're looking for it to turn orange, which it just did. So I'm gonna click on that. And one of the really fun things is you have listing assistant vision. So you can actually set your tone for what you want the AI to produce. So let's look at the different options. One thing I noticed was there's actually a lot more options for the tone that I thought. So let's look at all of them that there are. They're slightly funny, very funny, storyteller, verbose, professional. And then if you keep scrolling, there's even more. 
So they have concise, just the facts, antique or vintage, sports or athletic, bookworm, persuasive, or you can add your own. I'm going to choose very funny for this and see what it comes up with. And then once I choose the tone, and you can have it the same for each one or you can change it, I'm going to click on Launch Listing Assistant. And it's going to look at those six photos and it's going to create the listing from there. All right, let's take a look. So the listing title, Ed Hardy Men's Leather Bifold Wallet with Skull and Flames Black, which that's pretty precise. Uh, you can put your custom SKU. So I'm going to put spare shelf since that's where I'm at. And then the draft button is if you want it to go into list perfectly drafts, which is what I always click on and make sure I don't enable because then when I go to my computer to list my items, then I know that the ones that are in draft are the ones that I just created. It has the color, material, size. You can put your price if you'd like. And then, oh boy. <laughs> Oh, I wasn't expecting that. This is a good first one. I'm going to have to definitely change some words. <laughs> Looking for a wallet that screams badass while keeping your cash safe? This Ed, Hardy, this Ed Hardy gem has skulls, flames, and leather. Perfect for the inner rebel. And then it has some bullet points. Bifold design, genuine leather, iconic Ed Hardy skull and flames, multiple card slots, ID window, comes in branded tin case and then it actually noticed that there was a small tear on the packaging so when you're taking pictures make sure you're taking really good pictures even of the defect so wow I'm definitely gonna have to go back in and take out that word and replace it with something else so it's not 100% perfect you do want to still proofread um, but it didn't take that long to do all right so let's go to another one I've got these really cool they are from the 90s, they're LA gear, and they're ankle and wristbands, and if you grew up in the 90s like I did, then you will know exactly what these are. So let's see what they come up with this. All right, once again, I'm going to go down, I'm going to select my images, one, two, three, four, five, and I'm going to add them. And the button is orange, I'm going to click that. Let's change it from very funny. To storyteller let's see what happens all right so let's go down okay so vintage LA gear head and waist and ankle in wristbands 1985 and one size yep um, step back into the vibrant era of the 80s with these original LA gear bands perfect for the nostalgic fitness enthusiastics enthusiasts or collectors and then it gives all the details and then it even adds packaging shows minor wear from age all right these are made in canada but these are vintage they're just wallpaper border all right so let's go and choose the photos of this item one two three four five six seven i think i'm going to choose maybe antique or Vintage, since these are a little older, and let's do Launch Listing Assistant. It doesn't say what they're from, but there's an item that would I would consider somebody who likes that style would probably prefer this. All right, so definitely got the size right. Yep, they're 9 by 5 yards. There's a lot of four, so it picked up that there was four items, and... These vintage style floral border wallpapers from Imperial add a timeless touch to any room. With a pre-pasted and super vinyl finish, they are easy to apply. Next up, let's do... This is like a retro bowling shirt. And if you know me, I'm a bowler. All right, so I accidentally backed out of that, but I'm going to, at the bottom, hit the express listing. And then I... And just from there, pick the photos from that shirt. Let's choose just the facts and see what happens. Because I don't think I've ever chosen that one before. So we'll see what happens. All right. So it has Steady Classics XL, Stripe Button Up Shirt, Retro Style, 
I would probably take out polyester and then retro and then put bowling style because that's what it reminds me of. And I think when I was looking it up in the store, I'm pretty sure that that's kind of how I searched it was retro bowling shirts and came up with that. Oh, so interesting. Because I said just the facts, it didn't give a blurb. It just gave me the facts. So that will not be one that I will be using. All right, and behind me is a hat collection that we actually picked up at Goodwill. Uh, my husband, Casey, he called me and he's like, I need the cart. And so I go over to him and he's like got a big stack of them all in his arms. But we haven't listed them yet. We are going to. But there was this one, Marlboro hat, that I thought was pretty cool. So let's see what it comes up with for that one. And then I'm definitely not gonna do just the facts because I did not like that one. Let's do slightly funny because that's actually been the one that I have been using the most with this. And it does take a couple seconds, but way faster than me looking up items. All right, vintage Marlboro red corduroy. It did, okay, I was wondering if it was gonna pick up on corduroy and it did, snapback hat, made in USA. And then add a dash of old school cool to your wardrobe with this vibrant red Marlboro corduroy hat. Perfect for those who love vintage vibes. All right, and the last item, because I'm like, I need some good examples, just a variety of items to show you guys how it works. This is a non-electric bidet toilet seat that we actually got on one of the Amazon pallets that we had bought. So I thought that one might be a good one and let's see what it comes up with. And this one, you know I'm gonna choose very funny. Oh boy, here we go. All right, so it has the brand, what it is, the model number. So it definitely picked up on those pictures and everything. <laughs> Ready to upgrade your toilet experience, this non-electric bidet seat from Bridell. Brundell will have you feeling fresher than a daisy in no time. And it even picked up on the box and the tear that I took the photo of. Box dimensions, it picked up as well. All right, so hopefully you thought that was fun to do those examples with me. Um, but I want to touch on a couple things and some tips and things that I noticed by using this. I am listing way faster than I did before. And I think the main thing is I always said I would just take photos and then I would go list or I wouldn't look up items. And what I found myself doing was before I would look up the item on eBay, I would try to find something to sell similar either from my listings or or sold listings or somebody else's. If you're interested in signing up and using this awesome tool, we do have an affiliate code. It is Freeway Flippers, or there's a link down below, and that's an affiliate link to take you to their site to sign up. If you are already using this perfectly and you're not using this feature, I highly recommend using it. If you have the pro plan, opt into the pro plus so that way you can get that feature. Otherwise, I would upgrade your plan, try it out, see how you like it. It has completely changed the way that I list. If you have any other questions about using that tool, make sure you leave a comment down below and I will answer it to the best of my ability. But I guarantee if you try out this tool, it's going to make you list way faster in 2024. That's it for today's video. Until the next one, I'll catch you on the flip.